data science for social good fellowship is really to take data scientists and train them to work on problems to solve problems that actually matter. And what I mean by that is people who have computer science and statistics and economics and policy and analytical skills, giving them an environment where they learn how to not only solve real problems, but focus on problems that have social impact in areas such as education and energy and healthcare and transportation and public safety. So what we wanted to do was build this hybrid person who has all these different skills but also understands how to take real problems, communicate with people about those problems, solve them and then help figure out a way to transfer and, and, and transition those solutions into the real world to the partner organizations. I saw this advertisement for the fellowship and it said data science and social good and I thought to myself, wow, that's that's exactly what I'm looking for. Something that has all the neat data, technology, those interesting problems, those fun problems, those hard problems, um, but problems in the area of social good, something that is able to improve people's lives. I heard about the program through my advisor. Uh, it really pulled me in since the beginning just because I understand the amount of good that you can do with a little bit of data. The reason that we're doing this program with Argonne and the University of Chicago, and the reason that this is the right place to do this, is that this is one of the few places where we have the right expertise in the system sciences and in the social sciences to bring together and to answer these questions in a way that's much more holistic than just looking at one or the other. My background is in astrophysics, and I found that coming from the hard sciences to this program was a really interesting transition because I was still working with students, but I was doing so in a way that was expected to produce results rather than just papers. I'm working with Nurse Family Partnership. They're a home visitation program. They send nurses into the homes of at-risk women, first-time mothers. My team is working with a new government organization called the Cook County Land Bank. We're creating a new analytical tool to help the organization decide which properties to invest in to have the greatest impact in reversing neighborhood decline. Our project this summer was working with Mesa Public Schools to identify cases of missed educational opportunities and ensure that students go to colleges that best serve their educational potential. My team is working with the CTA. We're working on a problem that affects a lot of people around many cities, which is crowding on buses. There have been a lot of learning lunches, a lot of talks, and a lot of just person-to-person -person opportunities uh, you know, to hit the whiteboard and you know, to be learning different programming tools, uh, you know, different uh, packages within tools. A lot of people, when they came in, they really Really cared a lot about technical problems and what you sort of notice is they start talking to our partners they go out in the field and see how things these things get implemented how the data is actually collected so they went from thinking of a spreadsheet or a database as a data set to um, actual people behind them actual um, stories The goal is to provide these women with a source of support and health education. Hopefully this will make Bike Share a more viable part of our public transit system. By inferring a lot of these funding relationships, we let nonprofits spend a lot less time searching for information on the web and actually doing the work that they're trying to do to make the world a better place. Thank you for your time. We started off from such different backgrounds, from such different parts of the world, and we've really come together with this common purpose and, and goal. You'll spend your mornings at City Hall working to understand the problem the city faces, then afternoons coding together as a team trying to solve that problem. Each day is so full and fulfilling, you can't wait for the next one. I can't think of a better way to spend your summer. I wish I could do DSSG for the rest of my life, honestly. It's been a lot of fun. And this is the kind of work I want to do. You know, I'm interested in applying quantitatively grounded analyses and ways of thinking to problems that, you know, really keep me up at night, to problems that I think really matter.